YouTube. Today I will show you how to generate clock pulse using 555 timer IC. So for this you will need a breadboard, the 555 timer IC itself, a 9 volt battery, few connecting wires, one LED, 1000 microfarad capacitor and three resistors. So first go ahead and uh, place the 555 timer IC on the breadboard. After placing it, connect pin 2 to pin 6 on the 555 timer IC. Now to recognize the pins, as you can see, there is a notch in the 555 timer IC right here. So the pin below this is pin 1, pin 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So connect pin 2 to pin 6. Then connect pin 4 to pin 8. Now connect the capacitor between pin 1 and pin 2. The long leg, this leg will be connected to pin 2 and the shorter leg will be connected to pin 1. Then connect a 330 ohm resistor between pin 6 and pin 7 on the 555 timer IC. Then connect a 820 ohm resistor between 7 and positive voltage. We will take this strip as the positive voltage. So this resistor goes in between pin 7 and the positive voltage. Now place the LED in one of the unused slots. Now put a resistor between the negative of the LED to the negative of the circuit. We will take this strip as the negative for the whole circuit. And as you can see this is the shorter leg. So this, will, this leg will be connected to the negative strip. This resistor is placed to stop the LED from burning when current flows through it. Then connect pin 3 on the timer IC to the LED. Then connect pin 1 to negative voltage and pin 8 to positive voltage
finally connect the battery to the circuit. This positive one will go to this strip and the negative wire, black wire will go to this strip. As you can see, clock pulse is being generated and it is being verified by this blinking LED. You can change the frequency of the pulse using this formula that is T time period equal to 0 0.693 into R1 plus 2R2 into C1. Here R1 is the resistor between 7 and positive voltage. R2 is the resistor between 6 and 7 and C1 is the capacitor. By changing the values of R1, R2 and C1 you can change the frequency. In this circuit the frequency is approximately equal to 1 second. Thank you for watching.